Hi guys, it's Anya from uh, TV Lover and in this short video I would like to show you how I've set up a new WordPress installation on the Flywheel uh, hosting for my new project called the Web Design uh, Playground. So here I am on the getflywheel.com and I already uh, did that but just to show you real quick I chose the tiny plan for small simple installs for $15 a month. You can just click get started. It will take you to create an account and just fill all your uh, usual sign up uh, detail details and then you'll be able to log into your account. Okay, so here I am in the flywheel uh, dashboard. I already have one site here. I was invited to work on it, but uh, for this new project, let's uh, go ahead and uh, create uh, this WordPress uh, website uh, together now. So I'm going to click create a new site. And okay, I will be the owner. It's called uh, my plan I selected. I named it Web Design Playground and I want to use this plan. Obviously, I could have multiple um, plans for different websites, but uh, I have just just this one here. Okay, so what do we have here? I have to fill the site name. So web design playground. Okay, I'm just I just filled my uh, WP admin username and password and I chose the temporary domain uh, and now let's create the site. Okay, it says that I will uh, get an email. So uh, let me check my inbox. So I got this very nice looking email with all the details and I can click to view the site and it takes me back to my uh, dashboard. So let's have a look around. It says that the privacy mode is turned on. Uh, so if I go to open the page, it requests username and password. I can choose it here or I can just disable that for now. And what do we have here? Uh, we can see all our installed plugins from the flywheel dashboard. That's very, uh, you would see here if they're up to date of, or if they need an update, that's very useful. You would have some information on your performance and uh, statistics about uh, website visits and so on. Flywheel will also uh, create a backup uh, for you, so you don't need to worry about doing uh, all different updates. You can always back up to a previous uh, version. And there are also some advanced uh, settings here. Uh, I won't go into all these details uh, for now. Uh, let's get back here and uh, we can see that the site is not secure and we can enable SSL. So let's do that now. Simple as that, just one click and now uh, we have enabled SSL certificate so it's, it's nice and secure. But usually you would want to add your own domain so uh, they have this DNS help section for different registrants, uh, the uh, details instructions on how to redirect your domain uh, DNS to uh, your new server on a flywheel. I will use a different uh, approach because I'm using a subdomain and uh, it works a bit different. But you should be able to set up your uh, domain with your registrant very easily to point to that uh, server. 
So it took me a few minutes, a quick chat with support, and I was able to add my subdomain. And I also marked this as my primary domain, and it's secured with their SSL. So it was, as you can see, the flywheel dashboard is beautiful it's super easy to use support is so helpful and you can get your site up and running in like minutes so now if i just click this wp admin link it will take me straight to uh, straight to my dashboard where i can install the dv theme so under appearance themes i would just click add new and upload theme and here I need the DV zip file which I can download from my account on uh, the Elegant Themes. So here's the members area on the Elegant Themes uh, website. I can simply download the, DV, the latest version here, save it and now back here I can just drag this file here and click install now. Lovely. Now let's activate this. And now I can remove all the other themes I'm not going to use. I just need Divi. Okay, so uh, lovely. Let's have a look at my website. It's nothing special just the plain DV and uh, we are going to work on it in the next video so thanks for watching i hope you uh, like uh, flywheel hosting as much as i do highly recommend it bye